Volkov reporting uh, that the hatch now closed a bit between the Soyuz orbital module and the pier's docking compartment. We can see the Soyuz vehicle hatch closed and we can see the station hatch closed. I reported regarding the vehicle, the Soyuz vehicle hatch closed. Hooks and latches now open, standing by for the springs to initiate a push-off of the Soyuz from its docking port. Physical separation confirmed at 7.16 p.m. Central Time as the International Space Station and the Soyuz TMA-12, now flying free, passed over the Russian-Mongolian border. L looking good. Uh, we're uh, inaudible. Have, have you started the chips module? Yes, 24 seconds. About uh, three minutes from now, the first separation burn of about 15 seconds in duration uh, will be executed. Talking assembly is clear. We are not seeing any FOD. Sergei Volkov reporting a clean separation of the Soyuz from the port that was uh, the home of the Soyuz for 197 days. Yes, nominal indication is eliminated. One second lag. B1 selected after one second elapsed. Copy. Good luck, guys. We'll see you. See you on the ground. Happy flight. You guys are looking good. So do you. You were looking good all the way. As you can see uh, from the television uh, being provided from the landing site in Kazakhstan, uh, the uh, clouds uh, that had uh, descended over the central uh, steps of Kazakhstan uh, yielded to morning sunrise. The Soyuz capsule uh, landed on its side, which is not unusual, as uh, the parachutes pick up wind upon touchdown and drag the capsule off to its side. Looking at Sergei Volkov out of his uh, Soyuz capsule center seat, uh, now being attended to as uh, he acclimates himself uh, to a gravity environment for the first time in six months, reported uh, by uh, flight surgeons at the landing site to be in good shape. Richard Garriott being covered by a 
blanket. It's very chilly. Temperatures around the freezing mark uh, on this Friday morning in Kazakhstan. But he looks uh, hale and hearty, as reported to be in good shape by the uh, flight surgeon team. Although we have not had a clear uh, view of Alek Kononenko, uh, the report is uh, all three crew members out of the Soyuz capsule. Garriott now shaking hands with his father, NASA, former NASA astronaut Owen Garriott, wearing uh, a red jacket, uh, bearing the patch of his first mission, which was the second manned Skylab mission in 1973. Garriott, uh, a good view now of Owen Garriott on the right, shaking hands with his uh, son, a second generation space traveler, as is Sergei Volkov who Gary had rode home with uh, this evening to a landing about an hour and 25 minutes after sunrise Friday morning on the steps of Kazakhstan. And a good view of the ride home today for the Soyuz crew. The TMA-12 capsule, basically the crew compartment, the middle section of the three compartment Soyuz vehicle that uh, returned home uh, safely, bringing home uh, the Expedition 17 crew and spaceflight participant Richard Garriott to an on-target landing on the steps of